Yo, how's everybody doing? It's the Hawking Regime here today, coming at you guys with another TFGO League game, taking on the Kansas City Chiefs on the road this week, week number 10. We will be without the services of quarterback, former starting quarterback, Josh Allen, who suffered a shoulder tear in week number 9 against the LA Chargers at home, and will be out for really six more weeks because... He also suffered a two-game suspension for his yards per completion numbers at, I think, 15.76, which is over the league requirement of below 15.5 at the halfway point. So we are going to have to deal with that, along with the injuries to Marvin Jones and Damian Harris that we've already sustained and have dealt with pretty admirably at that with the outbreak of Matt Breida and Najee Harris. Doing a pretty great job, in all honesty, in revitalizing our run game. You know, the team is not is not despondent following the loss of Josh Allen, regardless of how effective he's been for us. We're going to we're going to rally. We're going to rally behind Josh, or not? Excuse me, not Josh. We're going to rally behind Cody Kessler. Oof. And there we go, McKissick. I think as we've run through a couple of users with this franchise as well. So ownership has been spotty. Aggressive play calling on defense. Not afraid to take some risks. I like it. Wow, what a throw. Ooh, good job. Let's see what his tendencies are on this first drive. I haven't played this guy before. Ooh, that was actually a good play call, honestly. And it's an interesting division. Very middle of the ground, I would say. Very middle of the ground. There we go, Naji. Mm, this is so run in the mill. Yeah, this looks like a zero blitz all the way, but I'm still gonna run it. Yeah. Oh, sweet! I can hot route him. Smart route him. That was foolish. Ooh. There you go, Palantine. What do you get out there? Okay, good run. Good run. Oof. Didn't quite get off in time. Interesting. Good play. Oh, hell yeah. Good job. Ran a comeback, and I just could not get back to the line of scrimmage. Come on, JD. Okay, two, two, three. Good. Okay. Touchdown.
job. All right, well, he ran forward for four yards, but it's fine. Job, Tremaine. Good job. Hold on. There you go, Naji. Power. Four or five. Good job. God damn it. I hate how I can't like, flip that over him. <laughs> oh, McKissick. Good job. And I'm Micah.
Ah, uh, we held. Good job, Rita. That's PI. Oh, Naji. So GG, GG to Mr. Pono. The Kansas City Chiefs will be taking this one 51 to three on the road in week number 10. Next week we'll be, I believe, traveling to Los Angeles to play the Rams, which should be interesting considering their current standing in the league. I don't think they're very much appreciated by a lot of people, I would say, in the league. They're in poor sitting. They're not loved around the league. Right now, they've been causing some issues for sure.
Not sure if I would give them the status of deplorable by others, but uh, they're, they're nearing that. I'm not sure they're uh, a team a lot of board members are fond of. A lot of carries today. Good game by Najee Harris. Radius slowed down a little bit, but it's okay. Under 21 yards. Charles Clay, Ray Ray McClown. Four tackles for loss. Four picks. Defense didn't see a lot of minutes anyways. They get a sack on me and a pick. It was frustrating. The GG. GG. Heading on into the main menu. Yep, the Rams will be our next opponent, week number 11. So looking forward to that one as we improve to 8-1 and one on the season. And I think our current standing is number one overall in the AFC and number one in the AFC East. So let's check that out real quick. Yeah. Number one in the AFC right now. Couple two lost teams trailing us, but uh, we've done pretty well. So good stuff, good stuff. Appreciate everybody tuning in for the stream slash video. Once again, hope you guys enjoyed. And yep, thanks for watching.